Anyone use Slack? Yeah? Cool. Anyone, anyone not use Slack? Anyone not know what Slack is? So Slack is like, Slack is kind of the death of Skype, I like to call it. Um, Slack is a uh, is, um, team communication tool. So it's a web-based tool. It also has a desktop app that I strongly suggest if you're using Slack, use the desktop app. Uh, and it just allows you to communicate with your team, like instant messaging and sharing files and um, you know, sharing all sorts of, so you've got, you've got a whole bunch of channels that you can set up. So we've got a marketing channel, we've got a management channel, uh, we've got a channel for uh, each of our different products and we've got channels for other different promotions and particular types of conversations. You can have different people in those channels so you can invite certain team members to come into those channels. Uh, it's direct messaging, kind of like you would on Skype. Uh, it allows you to share files really easily and beautifully, code snippets, um, text snippets. Um, what else does it do? Uh, Voice chat? Uh, they've just actually, they've actually just acquired a uh, company, and I can't remember the name of it, that that's allow you, uh, that will allow you to do voice chat and screen sharing. Okay, so the benefit over Skype is that it's got awesome search. Uh, the Skype search is terrible. If you want to add a file, if you want to share a file with someone, you just drop it in here and it's got its own files tab that you can, you know, I mean, shit, like if, you sh if I shared a file with you on Skype three months ago and went to find it now, <coughs> forget about it, like there's no chance. Um, the the actual, the, the way that the conversations and the way that the channels work are just so much more intuitive than Skype. Um, it's, yeah, I mean, it's kind of hard to explain how good Slack is until you actually use it. So I would just suggest take, it's it, like there's a free, I mean, again, it's free for up to five users. No, actually, I think it's free up for up to 10,000 messages. If you want to search your archive older than 10,000 messages, then it's five bucks per user a month. Uh, but up until then, it's free. So we're, we're currently still not paying for it. So we have every morning I log into Slack and it shows me our growth rate, our churn, our number of customers, everything that comes out of Infusionsoft, runs a little API script, our developer does that, I don't know how he does it, but he does it. And we have these little uh, custom emoji, our little mascots, our characters that tell me what's going on in the business. True story. Thank you.